Let us pray together the prayers of the people for Palm Sunday. Let us pray. Lord, your word sustains the weary. You bind up the brokenhearted and bring good news to the poor. As you enter into the chaos of Jerusalem, we trust you come to us in whatever turmoil we are experiencing. Even as some of us shout our praises, others among us cannot even murmur a word of hope. You see us all lined up by the road, isolated in our homes, incarcerated or incapacitated, worried about our loved ones and those who are ill, exhausted from caring for the sick and laboring at essential work, and you are moved with compassion. You come to Jerusalem getting even closer to the cross, pouring yourself out in order to bring forgiveness, reconciliation, and salvation. Seeing you humble, riding on a donkey, vulnerable, and unwilling to turn away from suffering, we are bold to pour ourselves out to you, crying Hosanna and God help us. We do not know how to voice our deepest needs or fears or hopes or longings, yet you know them all before a word is on our tongues. We cast everything before you, Lord of all, trusting your promise of an easy yoke and a light burden. We call out for healing for the sick, relief for the suffering, justice for the oppressed, relief for the exhausted, hope for the downtrodden and comfort for those who mourn. As we wonder what will come next, as we struggle with countless uncertainties and mounting anxieties, we look to you, the blessed one who comes in the name of the Lord. We look to you for help for assurance and for the peace that passes understanding. As we draw close to you and attempt to follow even to the cross, we rejoice in your near presence. We give thanks for your selfless sacrifice. We give thanks for the healthcare professionals, the grocery store workers, the frontline responders. We remain grateful for all of those on this way with us. United in you, Lord Christ, we stand together and stand up for those who have fallen by the wayside and walk with those who fear they have been forgotten. Strengthen us for the days ahead so that we will remain faithful to you, your will and your call until we see you face to face. We make our prayer in the name of Jesus Christ who taught us to say when we pray, our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. <laughs>